In this video, I will be doing a Miami Dolphins inspired makeup tutorial, and this is my third NFL look for this season. And I really hope you guys enjoy it. So first, what I did, I took my Too Faced Shadow Insurance, and that went all over my eye area, also on the bottom. And then on my lower lash line, I took NYX Jumbo Pencil in Milk, and it's just a white base. And that just went on my lid area. Also, if it sounds like I'm talking weird, I have a retainer, or actually a spring on my bottom teeth, so it's kind of hard for me to talk with that in. So yeah. Um, next, what I'm going to do is take my crease color for my crease. I'm using Max Orange eyeshadow, really, really bright orange, and a Mac 217 brush. Just make sure the base is blended on your lid so it will not crease. I'm going to blend this into my crease area. You don't have to be too precise about blending right now. Next, I'm going to go in with my lid color. And this is a palette from Beauty's Factory. I'm going to talk about this in a later video. But I got the 20 um, color palette. And I chose my own colors to go inside. I chose a bunch of greens, teals, turquoises, and blues. And so far, so good. I really, really like these colors. So on my eyelid, I'm going to take number 454. And that's this color right here. If you do not have this, you can use Electric Eel from MAC or Clarity, Big T, Cool Heat, Search for USA, any teal eyeshadow that you have. I'm just going to use a Kirkland flat shader brush since I couldn't find anything else. <laughs> and I'm going to pack this on my lid. Now I'm going to go back in with my 217 and just blend in my crease a little more, not too much because you don't want any of the color to fade away. Just like that. Now I'm going to take a dark navy because a navy, I think navy is another one of Miami Dolphins colors. That's what Wikipedia said. Take number 448 from Beauty's Factory and that's this dark navy right here. If you're wondering, these colors are the exact same things the 120 palette. These are just larger versions. But like I said, I'm going to talk about it in a later video. Um, I'm going to take a MAC 226. This is a little bit more fluffy. I'm just going to take that and apply my outer V and crease area. I'm not going to focus it too much. Now I have to make it look like that side. I actually screwed up and used the wrong brush and that's why it's way up there. But I'm just going to take that and blend to make it look like the other side. Taking it at 217 and I'm taking orange eyeshadow again and I'm going to blend out that harsh line. Like that. I know it looks extremely disgusting, but now I'm gonna go in with my highlight color. I'm taking medium plus from MAC as a mineralized skin finish. Now, one final time, I'm going to go in, I'm just trying to make sure both sides are kind of same, the same. Mm, I don't think so. I'm going to go back in with the tool on my lid and um, apply that. Also kind of blending that into the navy on my outer V. Now I'm going to do my lower lash line. Don't worry about this right now. That's going to be cleaned up with a concealer. I'm going to take the dark navy. And this is number 448. And I'm using a MAC 214 brush. And I'm going to apply this on like the outer two thirds of my lower lash line. Now I'm going to go in the inner corner with Crystal Avalanche, which is just a silvery white. I'm dusting off that brush really, really well, and I'm going to go into my inner corner with that. Okay, next what I'm going to do is go over that with a really, really, really pretty glitter. This is Reflex Pearl from MAC, and it's just like a pearl glitter. Uh-oh. 
And I'm going to spritz a synthetic brush. This is an e.l.f. small precision brush. I'm going to spray it with a little bit of Fix Plus. And I'm going to kind of, you know, pat that on both sides of the brush. Like onto a paper towel to get most of the moisture out. And I'm going to dip my brush straight into the jar. Tap off the excess. And brush this on top of the Crystal Avalanche. This is totally optional. You don't have to do this if you don't like glitter. I'm going to go in with some concealer. NW35 Studio Sculpt. And I'm going to clean up underneath my eye. And it's also going to clean up this outer edge. You could have used tape, but I don't do all of that. I'm just going to put this underneath my eye. Now what I'm going to do is my liner and my waterline liner and my mascara and lashes. I'm so glad I gave this a second chance. This is L'Oreal Carbon Black Linear Intense Liquid Liner. First time I said it sucked because I don't think I was really using it right now. I don't think I shook it or something. I don't know. But I just pulled it out randomly and decided to use it again. I really, really like it. I find it easier to use it like this, like sideways, instead of trying to use it from the point. And you get a, even, a more even application of color that way. Anyway, I'm doing it from my upper lash line. I'm going to wing it out. And then from my water line, I'm using Feline Cold Power. Mascara Zoom Lash. And from my lashes, I'm using number 747Ls. And you can find these at your beauty supply store. They look like this. Or like this from the side. And once I'm done, I'll return and show you what else I used. So I have completed my eyes now. I did this side of my face already. I'm going to go ahead and do this side. First, I took Sun Power Middle Line Skin Finish. And I used that as my contour with the 109 brush. Now I'm going to do the same to this side. I normally don't contour like that. But since I'm going out, I decided to this time. Um, for my blush, I'm going to go in with the Ben Nye Orange Pop, and I'm going to use the same brush. For my highlight, I'm going to use my Mineralized Skin Finish and Light Scapade. This is from the Fall Color Collection, I think. Okay, it is from the Fall Color Collection. I just completely blinked out. I thought it was like some other collection that came out on the same day, but no, no, it's the fall color collection. Anyway, I'm going to use that with the 165 brush. And lightly apply above my cheeks because I'm going to go in with another highlight right on top of that. I'm going to go in on top of that with my Silver Aura Mineral Last Year Sheen Powder. This is really, really old. I think it released two or three years ago. But it's still one of my favorite highlighters. I'm going to go in on top of that. It's kind of like a silvery highlight, which is going to complement the silvery glitter in the inner corner. Like so. Now I'm going to move on to my lips. I will be using an orange lip color. You do not have to wear this much orange, but orange is my favorite color. And when I'm wearing it on my eyes, I usually wear it everywhere else. So definitely switch it out for a nude if you're uncomfortable with that. I'm going to use Chicory. And that looks like this. Also, if you notice, I've also done my nails, and if you're concerned about the color, I actually use Phoebe from Zoya. It's a matte nail polish, and, well, you saw it right there. This is what it looks like. Y'all know I never, ever polish my fingernails. I've just never been into that as much as doing my toenails, but, like I said, I'm going out tonight, so I'm going to do something a little pizzazz. <laughs> but, um, on top of that, I'm going to go in with Good To Go. Pro long wear lipstick. I really want this to last through drinking and everything. And this is a um, bright orange color. The next NFL inspired look I will be doing is Redskins. So look forward to that. 
Um, I should already have three NFL looks posted already. I have the Colts. Well, this makes the third one, actually. I have the Colts and the Giants already posted. So, this is the Dolphins, and then Redskins will be next. And, yeah. Please check out my blog where I'll have pictures and information. And, of course, the list of all the products that I use. And I'll talk to all of you soon. Bye! That's the look. I'm done with my makeup. Oh, my hair. I need a perm. I kind of did something crazy in my hair. A little bit of curls up there. Something. I don't know. It looks a hot mess. My hands are ashy. I apologize. It's pretty bad. <laughs> it's one of those collections that came up. Let me, let me see. Let me see. Because I forgot. And of course, first I'm going to take the dark navy. Am I going to do this first? I think so. Yeah, I'm going to do this first. First, what I'm going to do. I had, I clearly had too much sugar, I'm sorry. But, um, First what I'm gonna do, I didn't mean to do that. And I'm stopping right there, because now we're gonna go, what I'm gonna do is take a 217, uh, oh my god. Oh, I forgot what I did next. And I'm gonna readjust myself. <laughs> and of course I don't know where it is, I never do. This video I'll be doing, uh, New York. New York. In this video I'll be doing, oh, oh, what the hell?